Hey everyone, Natalie here with All Four Paws and I thought it would be fun to do a little video where I show you some of the uh, day in the life type stuff that I do with my dog Beowulf. Um, so we just pulled up to Home Depot. We are about to get out of the car. This is a really great place that's sort of like a, an unofficial dog friendly store. It's not something they go out of their way to advertise. However, um, all the locations that I've been to in Florida um, are totally fine with a well-behaved dog coming through. I always make sure to keep Wolfie, you know, on a short leash at my side. I mean, he's very well mannered and I make sure that I give him plenty of time to go to the bathroom before we go in. So that's not an issue and just make a good example out of being somebody who brings their dog um, along to take uh, to take on errands. So I am going to get some new paint for my hallway and my bathroom and we're just going to check out the paint department and probably just do a lap um, maybe look around at the uh, garden section while I wait for the paint supplies. We're getting ready to go into Home Depot. Um, just a little tip, it's, uh, something I have a video on as well. I always teach my dogs to wait when I open the car. Wolfie, wait. So he knows to wait for my cue um, to get down. This way I can open the hatchback and get him out safely. So when I'm ready, okay, Wolfie. Good boy. All right. Ready to go, bud? So we are in Home Depot. We're gonna head over to the paint section. Just wanted to show you how nice and calmly he walks on a leash. And I think that so long as you have a well-mannered dog on a short leash, it's great to take them around with you to run errands. Come on, Wolfie. Let's go get some paint, bud. just finished up at Home Depot. I am just sitting in the car for a second. Wanted to um, finish up and chat with you a bit. So Wolfie got his usual warm welcome. <laughs> He's quite a sight to see trotting through pretty much anywhere. And I think because people aren't expecting to see a huge dog walk through, it just totally makes their day. Um, it makes me really happy too. It's, it's really nice to see how much the human animal bond can just change someone's day or their mood. Um, a lot of times I'll be running an errand, whether it's here or somewhere else with Beowulf, and I can read on someone's face, they just look like maybe they're not having a great day or they're just not in a good mood at the moment. And they see him and their face just lights up. They come over like smiling and hugging on him. And it's just, it really amazes me. It's so therapeutic to, um, to interact with a dog. Um, especially when you're not expecting it like that. So there he is. Wolfie, you tired, buddy? Um, and it's just really great. Like I was saying, it's wonderful for your dog. It's very enriching for them. It's wonderful stimulation. It helps get them very tired. Uh, a lot of times when I'll take Wolfie, even just to run one errand like this, if it's of like a half an hour, I notice that he's equally, if not more tired than um, after a walk. <clears throat> excuse me, because there's so much going on in the environment that the dog is processing and thinking and paying attention, um, and the car ride, the different smells, all of the things, the sensory experiences that the dog has contribute to um, mental stimulation and enrichment, which helps to wear them down. And as I like to say, a tired dog is a good dog. Um, so once your dog is tired out, they're typically better behaved. They don't have as much energy to be doing silly little things that maybe otherwise would be annoying you. Um, they'll usually come home and just rest after something like this. So yeah, that is my little, uh, recap of our fun little Home Depot visit. And I highly encourage you to, um, take your dog out in public places. Um, I have a couple videos about that. You can look through my page. I can try to link them in the description below. And, um, you know, the more you socialize your dog, the more you take them around, the more you do with them, the more they get used to these things and just behave um, better in these situations. And then you can enjoy your dog more as well. So it's just, uh, it's just a lovely thing. I hope everyone is enjoying their day. Thanks for tuning in and I'll see you all soon.